Hello friends, in this video we are going to learn how to show categories on the home page. So let's start the tutorial. So first of all, let's check. I have already done this, this part, right? So here we have shown the categories. So how to show these categories like here with the image and with the URL. So to, it gives a look nice on the home page. So let's start it. So first of all, what we have to do First of all, what we uh, let's go to the folder. So here is my project. It is Magento New HTML Magento New App Code App Orders Profit. And here I have created a block, right? Whether you want to create the block or not, it depends upon to you, right? So I here I am creating a one block, right? So here it is the block. And uh, after this, because uh, you can you, you can uh, also uh, whatever you want to send the data to the blog uh, to the uh, PHTML, you can write the function over here and get call it from in the blog part in the PHTML file, right? So it, this is the blog file. After that, uh, I have created the categories.phtml, right? So, and after creating this category.phtml file, I have called it in my Magento admin. So here I have added the code uh, contained pages. Go to the uh, content pages. So here I am calling the page in the home page. Edit this. If I open the content, see block class Magento view template app orders profit plus categories.phtml. So it's putting getting the file of the categories.phtml. Whatever code I have written in the categories.phtml, it will show in the this one. Where is home? This one. So let's design it. How I am doing, I am here. I'm using the object manager, which is not a good practice. So basically you can go and uh, write all this code in the uh, block part and fetch all this and then loop it, right? So that uh, it will be better on that. So I have just uh, adding the, this uh, file man uh, for this object manager and parent, uh, parent add category two, and I get all the fetch, fetch all their subcategories, like means the parent categories and show it in the home page and calling this block in the home page. So uh, it's already showing all the part and let's design it fully and uh, check how we can design it. So it is where if the design is this one. So it is this part with 100% short left display in line. No, leave it. This is, and after that we have, which is repeating. Uh, div class li elements. So let's make it display inline block with our twenty percent. Or you can make it or reduce it to get all these categories to 10%, right? So this is, and we are going to copy this one. Let's add it the style sheet, style over here. part after that we have added this one to this one here we can add this okay after this we can make it a round shape of the image so we can make this uh, cat hyphen image cat half an image anchor image tag width of it uh, 20 
30 pixels not picking up let's say I add this it's 20 pixels pixels water radius water radius 30 percent margin auto and uh, let's why it's not picking up that image image filter image border radius 20 pixels images are not accurate so I'm going to add is 50 pixels right pixels and the text align center right so this is looking nice and let's make it whole big one okay this is okay right now copy this and add this one and here what we have uh, we have added image that image let's copy and add this and here if you have added the image one let's copy this rule and paste it okay so this part is like it's okay right now and uh, yeah you can just flush the cache done let's reload it see it's looking nice let's put some of the round images uh, images logo simple. so we can add uh, some of the good images See what we can do it over here. No. So here I'm opening this image. Save this image. Let's add one of the image over here. Catalog categories. Content. Let this upload this simple one recent. Let's see how it looks. Save. Go to the home page. Why it's not showing? Categories. Let's check what's happening with it. Ah, it's there. But it's not showing over here. Let's check. Open, open link in a new tab. 
so can we remove this this is better I'm going to add it no testing also same con same image same this woman I'm adding the same one Now it's looking nicer. You can add uh, the same images. A woman is not showing. Let's check. I have the logo in the download section of this logo. Cash flush. Otherwise, we can do we can do the com, uh, deploy the content, then it will automatically come over here. So this is how we can design the full fledged categories on the Magento two. So let's move to the code. What I have done. Okay. So um, let's me go to my this one. So here, what we have to we have getting calling the object manager store base URL for getting the full URL to show the images. Category ID two that is parent category ID subcategory load cat ID degree right get all the children categories. It will whenever you pass whatever category of the parent suppose I'm going to pass category of forty thirty whatever it will show their sub categories right. So here I'm getting all uh, the main categories all the children categories. So here I'm getting all the children categories. Here I'm getting the image. I have created the image path like get base URL with image get attribute category PHTML image. And after that, you category sub URL, right? And uh, view more for the URL if you want to go to the next tab. Here you will open that respective category successfully, right? So the images are showing over here, and here you can also check this image is showing, but here it is not showing. It will come. Something is missed up, right? So this is how we can show the categories on the home page easily. Thank you so much for watching this video. Have a great day.